Hello everyone, my name is Sal C. I am in grade 9 advanced. And my name is Dear C. I am in grade 9 advanced. And we are from Bidran Mubawa School. Removing heavy metals from water. Utilization of waste aluminum cans and rice husk for the synthesis of some nano-sized and biopolymer zeolite for the efficient removal of cobalt and copper and zinc ions from EQ's media by absorption this method is useful to remove heavy method from EQ's environment to protect the organisms that live in these environment and prevent heavy metals from transfer in food chains these heavy metals is very dangerous because these have metal accumulate in the liver of the organisms causing cancers number one an innovative low-cost method for the synthesis of nano sides absorbents for wastes number two efficient removal of waste aluminium cans number three utilization of rice husk in the synthesis of nano sides polymers rice husk and wasted aluminum cans were exploited as silicon and aluminum sources respectively for the low-cost synthesis of some nano-sized and geopolymer. The synthesized products were efficiently applied for removing cobalt, copper, and zinc ions from EQ's media. Motivations of the project Number 1. Water pollution happens because of, the, of discharging harmful materials, often chemicals or microorganisms, into nat natural water states, which consequently causes serious changes in the quality and properties of water and these changes are harmful to human health everywhere. Number 2. World Health Organization WHO reported that about 80% of diseases and are attributed to water pollution because drinking water in different nations does not follow the state WHO standard. Number 3. Water pollution with heavy metal ions is dangerous because these ions tend to be accumulate in living organisms over time. Number four, heavy metal ions enter water supplies through mining and industrial activities or from acidic rains that break down soils in and release heavy metal ions into lakes, rivers, streams, and groundwater. Extraction of silica from rice husk. Number 1. Extraction of silica from rice husk was carried out using alkalist extraction method by mixing 50 grams of dried husk and 500 milliliters of 1.5 by weight NaOH solution. Number 2. The mixture was placed in a flask and boiled for 30 minutes. Number 3. The mixture was left overnight at a room temperature. Number 4. After the completion of the extraction process, the mixture was filtrated and the filtrate which contained dissolved silica. Silica sole was acidified by dropwise addition of HNO3 10% solution to convert the sole into gel.